comic get your gains hey welcome back gainers to another exciting episode of comic gains and if you're new to the show i'm adam i'm zach and this is the princess she dressed very nice today like usual bow down bow down so today is wednesday and wednesday is what's in the box so um we're opening up a brand new what's in the box so um this one's a little less organized isn't it yeah a little less a little organized. less organized has a bunch of random stuff in there, I'm Ooh, sure. This is random. And then uh, we got a couple of um, things we're going to open. We got something from our friend Thunder God we're going to open. And then also the princess picked up some comics from Black Flag Comics. So we're going to check that as well. And stay tuned to the end of the episode where we are going to announce the winner of our three Batman book giveaway. Yes. It's going to be exciting. I'm excited. I'm Batman. I'm Batman. You're going to have so many Batman books, you're going to become Batman. There you go. That's how you get those games. <laughs> Alright, so uh, before we uh, get into the box, what are we drinking there, Zach? Yeah, before the princess opens the box, I'm going to open this beer. And we're drinking a, uh, a brewery very close to us. We're uh, drinking the whole brewery? brewery? Yeah, drink the whole brewery. <laughs> so, we're drinking a brew from Crucible Brewing, our main brewster that we like to go to. And it's called, this beer is called the Jason Brohees. Brohees. Yeah. yeah, really good beer. Yeah. So, if you're ever in Everett, Washington, check out it's Crucible. Funny. Tell them Comic Gains sent you. Yep, and that's how you get those gains. What the? What are those? What are those? Crocs? Or yeah, Crocs. That's what Jason, Jason wears. Jason, come on. When he's in the water, you know. Mm, yeah, you don't. Whatever. I don't know. I don't know where I'm going. So I'm tired, guys. Delicious. Mmm. Oh. All right, you ready? Good. Ready yeah. for all new? <gasps> What's, What's in the, the box? I saw you with the box. What was in the box? Oh. What's in the box? What? All right, all right. Oh, okay. This is a good one. So we got uh, Kitty Pride and Wolverine number six. Uh, this is from 1985 in a 9.8. These are actually I really like these covers. It's like a it's a mini series that they did. Do you know how many was four, in it? Four, six issues. Six issues. Okay. Yeah, did it for six issues. It's Wolverine, Kitty Bride, hanging out, find some bad guys. The first issue has a really cool cover, in my opinion. I don't think I bought the whole collection of this, but I'm looking to do that. Well, I bought Raw, complete collection, but now I need to get them graded. Yeah, really good covers. I think there's one of them, there's a couple that are keys in that, right? Number one and number two or something like that? Maybe. Minor keys, I'm sure. Minor keys. But not major great keys. keys. But cool great. covers. I like the, the 80s covers of it. Those like one shots, you know? Yeah, 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 yeah. You can't beat them. It's 80s. You can't field. beat them. Join them. Can't beat them. Join them. All right. Next book. <gasps> What's in the box? Breaking my slabs. That's how you get those games. Oh. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> so. What is this? The bat. <laughs> I got. Think Batwing number one from 2011, 9.8. This is interesting. It's an unfortunate name because Batmean, don't look it up, guys, means something else. The too. Batwing? The Batwing. You gotta stretch it real tight. Uh, I'll let the princess know. <laughs> oh, that's for the whiteboard. I was Okay, next video. That's a cool cover, though. My whiteboard for the princess. So you, who is the Batwing? I still don't know. Okay, you just like the cover? It was an issue one of a uh, new character. I don't know if it's uh, his first appearance or not. I'll link it down it below. It doesn't say in the corner that it is, but... Sometimes CGC neglects. I like the, the outfit, duties. though. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Pretty yeah. cool. So it's another Bat Batman character. You know, it's in the family of the Batman. So it could potentially be worth something later on. So mm. if you find it for a dollar, pick it up. Uh, it, find it slab for a dollar, pick it up. Yeah, definitely. Right? <laughs> All right. So, what's in the box? Ooh, what is he got here? A thicker one. It's an old one. Ooh. Oh, jeez. This you is pick, cool. You picked a very good one. So, uh, we got the Star Spangled Comics number 65. Um, this is from 1947, so I'm going to say Golden Age. Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool. So, you got a Robin story and cover begins with Batman cameo. It's like one of his... 6.5. It's like one of his few solo stories that he did in the early Robin. days. Yeah. Yeah. I like the yellow cover, though. Yeah, that is technically a key. I think that's what it was. I'll link it down below if I was right or wrong. And what the solo... If the 
key appearances. One of his first solo stories. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah cool. How much you buy that for? A lot. A lot? And how much is it worth? I'll link it down below, but I'm sure it's a lot. <laughs> I have no idea. I don't really... I buy the books because I like them. Golden worth, Age, though. If they're worth more later on, that's an extra benefit. I like know? Golden Age when it's like the, the characters that you know, you know? I don't really like necessarily the old Western Golden Age stuff. Like... like the bullet and or the western, yeah, they're or, okay. The rawhide right. kid, the well, well gun smoke, gun smoke. I think that's a, a TV show and a radio show, and I think there's some comics. Mm -hmm. of gun smoke, gun smoke. A little bit of knowledge for the day. Okay, so <gasps> what's in the box? Oh yeah, what's in the box? Yeah, I didn't even know that was in there. Yeah. Oh, that was mine, I think. Oh, yeah, whatever. Oh, oh here we go. I'm, I know I bought this part of a little collection on eBay. Okay. You know, so in the, in the auction and everything. So you got Gen 13, number one. You got a cover by, uh, is it J. Scott? Yeah, it's a J. Scott Campbell cover. Gen 13 goes to Madison Avenue cover. Ooh, that's cool. 9.8. It's cover F, Zach. Cover F. For you got, fun. What's the main girl's name? Like Wild Child or something? Or is that the, no. is that the dude? No. The dude's That's, name's Wild Child, right? No, 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 no. It's like, oh, oh my gosh. It's like Groot or Grunt. Gr What's the chick's name? Oh, her last name's Fairchild. Don't oh, Fairchild. That's what I was thinking that. Yeah. Al Alex Fairchild. And then the girl with the, like, the purple hair is Roxy. I remember her. Oh, my God. It's like and his, then his favorite comic. Then Rainmaker. Uh, I, have, I need to re reread What's that. What's their first appearance? Oh, it's Death, Death Make Black. Uh, there's a rare gold outline of it, but it's still Death Make Black. I finally found it. I was like so happy. Did I? I don't remember if I sent that into CDC. If I did, I hope it gets a nine eight. I don't think that, I sent it in. I'll give it a nine eight. Ah, uh, there you go. Thank you. That's that's how you get. Oh, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> What's in the box? Let's do this. What's in the what? We're going four today. Started out light. Oh. Was that four? Yeah. Oh, I, so. oh, I didn't want it to end. Yeah, I know. Wow. We gotta, we gotta wow. save some for right. you know for them for the future. All so, right. So first one we're gonna open. Um, so we got something that we bought from our friend Thunder God on. Uh, it was actually on Thunder God's own auction that we bought it on. So check him out. If you're not subbed to Thunder God, sub him up. Hit the notification bell for him so you know when he's dropping an auction because his auctions are are fired. There's some really really good people show up on his auctions. And uh, this is the first thing we've ever bought from him, I think. Hmm. I believe so. Yeah, cool. Happy with happy with this. So let's take a take a look in here. We're also glad to give him a shout because he deserves it. It feels like we shout out just about everybody, but him, and maybe a few other people. If you guys know of a good person to shout out, let us know down below. I mean, we or, want to spread the love. Also, um, leave us. Uh, a picture of your gains on Instagram so we can share your flexing. We'll give you a shout out as well. Mm -hmm. Free. Totally free. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Okay. Some people get some really amazing stuff. I and mean, it always yeah. gets me really excited to see that. I oh, know. It's nice when people get good gains. Mm hmm. Oh. Heard someone uh, in the state, like, I think a year or two ago, got an Albedo one for like. What five dollars or Albedo two. two? Excuse me. Yeah, well, I got in the like dollar bin. Yeah, like and the guy actually honored it. It was like, what? That's crazy. Really nice guy uh, that honored that. But uh, wow, that's an expensive game. All right. So he's like, let me see here. Hey, princess, added two books. Thought you might like this cover. Is a mix of. Uh, I won't say a mix of two characters that she she will probably like. Keep it a little bit of a mystery here. Well, if you know the show, you can probably guess what the characters are. Who who the princess likes? Who the princess likes? Okay, bottom. That doesn't matter. All right, I'll do this one. I think these are the AOKs. Oh, that's cool. Yes, literally a mix. Oh wow, that is cool. So Amazon. Uh, so that's the Wonder Woman and Storm mixed together. I think that's in that that series where DC fought Marvel. I actually really like that series. Yeah, it went from Marvel to DC to uh, all access, and then they did this kind of stuff. Yeah, well, yeah, at the very end of the series, they they merged into one. Mm -hmm. We had like Wolverine and Batman together, Spider Man and Superboy. Yeah, the Superboy one was hilarious. Superboy and Spider Man. 
Oh, here we go. Jeez. Oh, Ooh, nice. really cool. Justice League America, JLA number 118. What is she saying there, Zach? T-Groff? T-Groff! You got T-Groff. Satana on the cover? Satana. Oh, is it backwards? Sat. Wait. Forget. Ah! That's, that's really cool. How did the princess pick that up? Uh, someone told her. She's much smarter than us. Uh, that's the, mm -hmm. that's the big debate. Uh, not sure she's cool really book smart. though, dude. It's a, it's oh. A Tana. oh, this is a great. Oh, this is a great cover. There it's, a Michael, it's a Michael Turner. Sorry, oh. uh, Princess. It's a nice Michael Turner female cover. Ooh. Yeah, the, actually, the original art was for sale on eBay or something like that. Yeah. Yeah, they went over ten grand for it. So wow! I, I passed on it. It's a great cover. Oh, the Witchblade Collected Edition. Oh, yeah. I like the Square Bound book. Yeah, it's great. Is that no, that should be number one too? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, actually, the Princess should read that. It's actually a really good story. Learn a little bit about Witchblade. Witchblade is B A. It's B A. B A. Okay. That this is the one that we actually bought in the auction that I'm super stoked about. So we've got. Ooh, yes. Uh, you got Invincible Iron Man number nine, and we're like really in this house. We're really big fans of Riri Williams, so we got we got both of her technical first appearance, and then also now first appearance in the costume. Yeah, which I'm not really sure for her that they kind of both seem equally as big. I don't know if you guys think one's bigger than the other. Definitely let us know in the comments which one you think is a is a more important. But I think they're almost. It's weird. They're almost equal. Compare like a lot of the other heroes. Yeah, I think honestly, number seven <clears throat> should be the big key, but number eight should follow it just behind because it's a suit appearance. Yeah, the suit. But that's just my opinion. Everybody. I think it's opinion. important though when you finally put on the costume. But cool book, and uh, dude, we're definitely gonna get that slabbed. So uh, stay stay tuned to see what we think. I the grade looks close to a nine eight, so I think it's definitely slab worthy. Oh, it, talking about slabs. We're gonna be getting some stuff back from CGC pretty soon, so we're gonna be. Uh, uh, I think CGC most of them. Unbox most of them are the princesses books, right? Yeah, a, a lot, lot of them. A lot of them are the princesses. Books. Yeah, she sent in a lot of stuff. So this next one we're gonna open. This is from Black Flag Comics, which is um, a comic website you can buy stuff from. So not another YouTuber, not another person we know generally, but if uh, if you get good deals from them, maybe get some good stuff. I've never heard of them before, but I think we've opened something like this. I don't even remember. Maybe maybe we did. I don't know. But I'll, I'll so, link them down below. It's right there. They're so they got a cool sticker on their Black Flag comics. I'll link them in the comment. Not the comments. The description. The description. Yeah. So, I mean, they, they probably have their exclusives. They probably also have the, hey, buy this book at 20% off pre-order. Um, uh, other collectibles, some unique collectibles. The really cool thing about these websites is that they usually always do have unique stuff just to the Ooh, website. It's like wrapped really Sometimes well. they're like just straight fire. You just get straight. some stickers, black flag comic stickers. You know, the main people are like unknown comics. Uh, well, not not Jim Mint. Uh, street level the hero. The comic Mint, street level hero. Uh, Scorpion, there, there's so many. There's so many. What? That was interesting like packaging. Tissue paper. They put tissue paper in it, and uh, it had no real use. They could cry. You're like, well, oh. if they come damaged, then you will. Okay. <laughs> I don't know idea what she you bought. Don't need to... Ooh. Oh, uh, no, I have no idea. Okay. Let me go first? Yeah, go first. Whoa. Oh, cool. Okay. You must have got these pretty quick then. So this is Punchline number one. So this is her first solo series, which um, there's a couple of these books that were, were pretty hot when they were coming out. So yeah. I like that cover though. Yeah, it's, it's a fancy cool. cover. Oh, is this uh, Natalie Sanders? Uh, Natalie Sanders, okay. Okay. Wow, mm. this is really cool. I actually like this better I, than that cover. I heard this story was actually really good too, worth a read. It's the same cover, it but is? like, <laughs> it's cool. Oh, is that the magazine one again? Yeah, it looks like the magazine. Did, oh, she must have did the other magazine cover too, right? Mm, most likely, most definitely. Ah. Yeah. I met, I think I already said I met Natalie Sanders. Uh, nice lady, nice lady. Don't sit uh, on your book. 
All right, so cool books from Black Flag Comics. Awesome. Got some of those gains. A little bit of gain action. So um, now's the time to show where we are going to announce the giveaway. And I think we got the books right there. So one of a little quick reminder of who's going to be winning or what they're going to be winning. We got Suicide Squad. And we got the Joke. You're the villain Joker. Supposedly supposed to be a good read. Yeah. And. Oh, we got the. Um, Oh yeah, Batman Who Laughs. Number six, I Number think. Number six. I believe number six. Yeah, number six. So three right. really cool books. Without further ado. Let's see who wins these books. Okay. We'll get fancier at this one day. Well, all good. Whatever. All right, there's uh, 56 unique comments. Can you see click, it? Click, click. Well, the light is kind of like, uh, I can't even say this. 1971. What? I don't know what it says. Last Cruise? Last Cruise, 1971. I like the great information, entertainment, and of course the princess. Thanks for the awesome content. Stay safe. Awesome, dude. Yeah, he, got, he always comments on her stuff. Like, I... Yeah, I, I, I don't know. Exactly I, I don't have the you. best memory, okay? But awesome, dude. So Except you won comments. those you won those comments. three books. So if you watch this video, uh, message us back either through the show or on IG so we can get your address and ship them out to you so you can enjoy those Batman books. So mm. congratulations, dude. Awesome win. Awesome game. Very good. So yeah. um, that's going to be the show uh, for today, guys. Just a couple announcements coming up. Uh, our next Saturday video, we got one more superior box to open and we've been fired this time we had two good boxes so far so hopefully our last one's a good one we're hoping so um stay tuned for that so you guys show up is the is the princess wearing anything special for that video oh she's wearing something special so stay tuned for that as well also guys um as usual if you like our show love our show hit the subscribe button hit the like button hit that notification bell so you always know what's going on so in case Coco shows up, you always get to see her. And yeah, anything else, Seth? Yeah, you gotta share. And how do you do that? Because sharing is caring. No. Is that you gotta be a stunt, like a stunt person. You know, like, like uh, what's that one guy? Um, oh, whatever, I can't, I can't never. Anyways, you gotta be a, like a stunt, stunt driver on a bike, doing all these crazy flips, spins, turns. A lot of, lot of, lot of amazing stuff. You're talking like Evil Knievel. Evil Knievel. Kind of like that, a little different. Maybe you look a little bit like Nicolas Cage. And, you know, you, your I believe your father's dying? Or maybe I'm thinking of the comics. No, I think his anyway, father's his dying. His father's dying. You make the deal with the devil. He kind of wipes your memories a little bit. And your father lives momentarily. And then, of course, the devil, you know, he never really keeps the promises very well. And then uh, you become the spirit of vengeance. And, uh, and your head catches on fire? Your head catches on fire. Yeah. Ah! But it's okay, and you have a guiding spirit to kind of help you figure out some things, and then you go after Blackheart, and uh, yeah, and you take him out. That's how you become a uh, Ghost Rider. Ghost Rider. Ghost Rider. Guys, I'm sorry. I'm tired right now. I don't know. I, yeah. Anyways, <laughs> that's how you get those gates. That's how you get them. All right, guys. Everybody, stay safe out there. We'll see you on Saturday for some more games for updates on Game Nation. Get them games. Get them. Get them.